Hello and welcome, this is Paul Pappas from Mortgage Choice. So you've decided to purchase your property, you've done your numbers, you know your budget, and you know how much you can borrow, and you want to formalise the next step in terms of buying your first property. That next step, of course, is a pre-approval. So what is a pre-approval? A pre-approval effectively is a preliminary home loan approval that will allow you to place you in a situation where you can purchase a property if the right property comes up. So it allows you to commence your search with confidence of knowing of exactly what your numbers are um, in terms of your how much you can spend and how much you can borrow. And if the right property comes up, you can move accordingly. So really what it allows you to do, I call it a fishing license and it lines your pockets with a, um, a budget um, to know exactly what you can borrow and then spend on a property. Um, it, it allows you to make an offer on a property and make negotiations on a property if you find the right property and gives you the confidence of knowing that you can also bid at auction if required. Um, please do talk to us about um, once you do find a property in terms of you know whether you're in the right situation and position I should say to negotiate whether that's a property via being sold at auction or private treaty. Um, but you, you know to start negotiating a property make sure that your pre-approval ticks all the boxes of, of what you're looking at doing. Okay, it's valid for three months by law, unfortunately no longer, and needs to be reviewed after that um, to make sure that your situation hasn't changed um, after that three month period. Um, please make sure that your pre-approval is fully assessed. And this is a very, very important point because what we're finding now the, um, over the more recent times is that most banks and a lot of lenders are only issuing what's called um, um, desktop, computerized, verbal, call it whatever you like types of pre-approvals. Um, and to me, that's very dangerous because like I said before, a pre-approval allows you to purchase a property and potentially sign a contract. So if, you, if you're looking at signing a contract on a property for whatever you know, significant amount of money that you're looking to spend for the very first time, your pre-approval needs to be fully assessed. And that's the only pre-approval that we will arrange for our clients. Now, what do I mean by a fully assessed pre-approval? I'm, I'm talking about um, reviewing your um, income documents, your pay slips, your bank statements, your expenditure via your credit cards or other loan facilities that you might have to make sure that you qualify um, for, a, uh, for a loan and give you a, a, a proper fully assessed pre-approval. Okay, so in other words, it's, it's exactly the same documentation that is required for you to obtain it as a loan approval once you buy property. So without a fully assessed pre-approval, how do you really know that you are going to get the loan um, approval that you're, that you're expecting if it's only a desktop or a verbal or computer generated pre-approval? Because the bank's interpretation of your um, numbers or your situation could be very different, different once they see the numbers. So very important and critical that you obtain a fully assessed pre-approval before you start um, sign or negotiating on properties or even bidding at, a pro at an auction. Very, very important. Um, a pre-approval is always indicative and subject to change. And, and we are seeing some changes in particular in the lending environment in terms of, you know, not only interest rates, but the lender's um, conditions in terms of their, their assessment and qualification criteria for assessing loans. So uh, again, it's important to be talking to us through the whole process to make sure that your pre-approval is still valid um, and that um, it, you know, we, we can obtain a formal loan approval based on your same situation. So it is a very good indication, but subject to change. As always, look, please talk to us um, in, in relation to obtaining your pre-approval, make sure it works for you and make sure that it is a fully assessed pre-approval. Our contact details are here for you. Thank you for attending.